let's take a problem on capacitors we are given a combination of capacitors in the circuit it is required to find the electric field due to a point charge q which is the sum of the charges on the 4 microfarad and 9 microfarad capacitors at a point 30 meter away from the point charge so let's first simplify the circuit we can see that the 3 microfarad and 9 microfarad capacitors are in parallel so their equivalent capacitance will come out to be 3 microfarad plus 9 microfarad which is equal to 12 microfarad so we can replace the circuit by a 4 microfarad capacitor in series with a 12 microfarad capacitor and these two are in parallel with a 2 microfarad capacitor connected by a voltage source of 8 volts across its ends. Now we can see that the 4 microfarad capacitor and 12 microfarad capacitor are in series. So their equivalent capacitance will come out to be 4 into 12 divided by 4 plus 12 which is equal to 4 into 12 divided by 16 which comes out to be 3 microfarad so finally we are left with a 3 microfarad capacitor in parallel with a 2 microfarad capacitor connected by a 8 volt source across its ends. Now the charge developed on the 3 microfarad capacitor can be given by Q is equals to CV where C is 3 microfarad and V is 8 volts since the 3 microfarad capacitor and the 2 microfarad capacitor are connected in parallel so the voltage across both these ends will be equal to 8 volts so we have the charge on the 3 microfarad capacitor equal to 24 micro coulomb now the charge on the 3 microfarad capacitor is the same as the charge on the 12 microfarad and the 4 microfarad capacitor each because the current that flows through the 4 microfarad capacitor and the 12 microfarad capacitor is the same and equal to the current flowing through the 3 microfarad capacitor so let's say i is the current flowing through the 3 microfarad capacitor which is equal to the current flowing through the 4 microfarad capacitor which is equal to the current flowing through the 12 microfarad capacitor so we have i is equals to q upon t so the charge on each of the 3 microfarad 4 microfarad and 12 microfarad capacitors to be equal that is Q upon Q on that is the charge on the 3 microfarad capacitor is equal to the charge on the 4 microfarad capacitor which is equal to the charge on the 12 microfarad capacitor which comes out to be 24 micro coulomb which we found earlier that is the charge on the 3 microfarad capacitor is 24 micro coulomb now we know the charge on the 4 microfarad capacitor we have to find the charge on the 9 microfarad capacitor so let's take this part of the circuit out we have the 3 microfarad capacitor in parallel with the 9 microfarad capacitor and this combination is equivalent to the 12 microfarad capacitor So the voltage across the 3 microfarad capacitor and the 9 microfarad capacitor is same and equal to the voltage across the 12 microfarad capacitor which is given by V 
dash, let's say V dash is the voltage across the 12 microfarad capacitor, which is equal to the charge on the 12 microfarad capacitor upon C dash, where C dash is 12 microfarad, and the charge on the 12 microfarad capacitor is 24 microcoulombs upon 12 microfarad. So V dash comes out to be 2 volts. So now we know the voltage across the 9 microfarad capacitor which is the same as the 12 microfarad capacitor. So the charge on the 9 microfarad capacitor is equal to C into V dash where C is 9 microfarad and V dash is 2 volts which we found earlier. So the charge on the 9 microfarad capacitor is 18 microcoulombs. So now we have the charge on the 9 microfarad capacitor which is 18 microcoulombs and the charge on the 4 microfarad capacitor which is equal to 24 microcoulombs. So the sum of both the charges will come out to be Q on the 4 microfarad plus Q of the 9 microfarad capacitors comes out to be 24 plus 18 which is equal to 42 microcoulombs. So the electric field due to the charge comes out to be E is equals to KQ upon R square. This is the electric field due to a point charge according to Coulomb's law. So here we have Q is equals to 42 microcoulombs. R is given to be 30 meter. And K is 9 into 10 to the power 9 Newton meter square per coulomb square. So we have E equals to 9 into 10 to the power 9 into 42 into 10 to the power minus 6 upon 30 square which comes out to be 9 gets cancelled with 6 we're left with 3 here 900 gets cancelled with 9 and 10 here so we are left with 420 newton per coulomb so the electric field due to a point charge q which is the sum of the charges on the 4 microfarad and 9 microfarad capacitors at a point 30 meter away from it is 420 newton per coulomb.